my dear students hope all of you are fine i am introducing myself i am mohammad ashikur rahman lecturer department of ict myerson college today you would learn how to create a table by using sql command so let's start here in the board you can see syntax of the create statement how to write actually so first of all you have to write create table then space table name here you, you have to write table name then first bracket start with first bracket then first column data type then size comma again if you want to more uh, add more column column name then data type size uh, then you can add more if you want to so on and then first bracket close semicolon so this is the actual syntax uh, of the create statement so let's see an example suppose this is our stem uh, here you can see a table name student then column name id name age and also uh, address so we have four columns so how to write sql command by using create so let's start here answer first of all you have to write create table create table then you have to write table name here our table name is student you can see so write student here then start with first bracket and you, you also know that uh, we have to write uh, column name first column second column third column and fourth column serially then first of all you have to write first column name then data type id id is uh, uh, here data type is number you have to write uh, data type here in the data type box number then size i take here two then comma then we have to write more column serially accordingly name then ace and then address so here uh, i already wrote a column name so then we have to write data type name in the name box name field uh, here data type is text because here we use here a to z uh, characteristic that's why and we i took here 20 size a is a is number we wrote uh, we actually wrote like um, 19 14 55 that's like this so here you also write number i took here two size and then address here i took again data type is text because of uh, we use here lots of uh, characteristic character like a to z and then i took here 50 50 size and then finally close it first bracket and semicolon so that's the actually answer uh, from the stem how to write create a table by using sql command we are using microsoft access 2016 now let's see in practical how it's work first of all you have to select blank sheet then click create then click query design you can see here new interface then click sql command then you can see here we can write we have to write create table then our table name here student is our table name then first bracket then write all fields with data type here id data type is number comma then name data type is text comma then is data type is number comma and then finally address data type is text and then first bracket 
semicolon now we have to click run command here you can see student table appears click student you can see here is our student table you can see id name age address so my dear students now we will learn about alter and drop command we can add new field by using alter command and delete any field by drop command here you can see the syntax to add new field alter table then you have to write table name then second line add a double d then you have to write field name and then space data type and finally semicolon now see an example to add a new field you can see here student table here we have id name and dob date of birth those are field name so my dear students you can see uh, here is the output you can see we add new field group field so how to add new field first of all you have to write alter table then student here is student is our table name and then write add then space group and then space text here group is our new field and text is data type so this is the way to write sql command to add new field now you can see the syntax to delete field you have to write alter table then table name then second line drop you have to use drop then field name semicolon so this is the syntax now let's see an example you can see student table here we have uh, id name date of birth and also group field those are fields so if we want to delete a uh, group field so what should we do so here you can see our main table and we have to remove or delete group field so what should we have to write alter table then student student is our table name and write drop then group and then semicolon so this is the sql command to delete any field like we will delete group field so this is our output you can see student this is our table table name and then id name and dob here you can see there is no group field so my dear students it's very easy if you want to learn or if you uh, practice more and more then this is very easy for you that's all my dear students hope you have learned from my today's class if you have any problem then ask me or ask your sub teacher don't stop to learn keep practicing allah hafiz